is expected to end the week. I'll be back in just a few minutes with a full UK weather forecast. Well, Mary, there is more substantial rainfall on the way for many parts of the UK over the next few days. Not good news, of course, for areas that are already saturated due to the last couple of weeks of heavy rainfall. In fact, the Met Office has issued a couple of warnings to cater to this. The yellow warning, our lowest warning for rainfall in place from tomorrow until Saturday, just to cater to that. Rivers and fields very topped up and very full in that area. And it's just going to take a little bit more rainfall for those potentially just to run over and cause a few problems in terms of localised flooding on roads in those areas. Very unsettled conditions as we go through the rest of the week. Flowers increasingly to snow, particularly across Scotland, as we head through into next week. Here in West Yorkshire, I think fog will be the problem tonight. Here's the forecast for all of us now. So we have further rain at times over the next few days. Some of that really will be quite heavy, breezy conditions. It isn't going to feel particularly cold, but we could see some problems with mist and fog, and there's certainly the risk of localised flooding for parts of the UK as we go through the rest of this week. As we can see then, low pressure very much in charge of things. It's unsettled with a succession of fronts moving in over the next couple of days. Bits and pieces of showery rain that will merge together to form something heavier as we go through the next few days, and it will be breezy at times. As we focus on this evening's details, it isn't going to be particularly cold tonight. It shouldn't be frosty, temperatures around 8 or 9 degrees for many of us. But we are going to see that batch of heavy showers moving up from the southwest as we go through the course of the night, bringing heavy spells of rain to the south coast by the time we get to tomorrow. And of course, across eastern Scotland, further heavy showers continuing with mist and fog on trans-pennine routes tonight and for eastern parts of England. On to tomorrow's details, we'll see those heavy showers migrating their way northwards and eastwards during the course of the day, putting down some really heavy showers with rumbles of thunder here and there. In between, there will be a little bit of sunshine here and there. It could be in short supply, though. And across Scotland, it's an unsettled day with those spells of rain leading, of course, to that warning that's in place until Saturday. Winds picking up a little bit as we go through the next few days. However, tomorrow afternoon will actually feel quite mild. And if you're in the sunshine, perhaps 15, or 16 Celsius, feeling pleasant in the southeast. If you are worried about flooding in your area, you can always check out the Environment Agency website for the warnings where you live. Take care over the next few days. Plenty more unsettled weather ahead. Okay. Joe, thank you for that.